Hey, Eric Poulin here, your temple and family history leader. I hope you are safe and surviving the COVID-19 crisis. Let's get into some interesting family search things. This day we're gonna we'll use our web browser on a computer instead of a mobile device. It's interesting to find out where you came from. Where did you really come from? And if you have some family history already completed, go ahead and click on the link that's uh, supplied in this email and log into your family search or church account. We're at the URL, uh, familysearch.org slash discovery slash explore slash generations. And for me, what I'm seeing is where did my family come from? So I'm gonna take you through this in just a few minutes to show you how to use this tool and explore a little bit. Um, but it's very interesting when you do this for your own family to understand where you came from. Now, what we're looking at here under the Generations tab is where are my ancestors from? In the bottom, you can see that we're showing uh, eight generations here. So there's 307 individuals found. And you can uh, zoom in on these areas. So there's a huge sele selection of people from the Quebec area. Not surprising. Poulain, right? Last name is a French name. You can zoom in here and see where these people were from, a kind of all along the St. Lawrence corridor, which is uh, pretty common. That was a very big, um, you know, logging and, and there's a, a big community of people there as people settled in Canada in the early uh, earlier days of Canada. Um, but also, so interestingly, there are some people in way, way North Ontario. Uh, for me, I had one or two people down here in the United States, mostly from Canada though, and Quebec area but also um, some people from, of course, France, right? The people from Quebec usually came from France originally, but I have quite a few people from Sweden, from my mom's side. My, in fact, my grandparents on my mom's side came directly from Sweden, but we're gonna see that in a second. So if you click over on these other tabs, we can explore a few other things. So I'm gonna click over on family lines. This lets me see where did my family lines come from. So what you do on this screen is over on the left hand side, you click on, okay, where do we want to explore? So I'm going to go through my dad's generations. Um, so I'm going to go to my, clicked on my dad. Now I'm going to click on my grandfather. Then I'll click on my great grandfather and his great grandfather. And you see, as I'm doing this, um, these lines are adapting as we get to the other generations. We'll keep on going up and you see there's more people from Quebec. This person came from Northern Quebec. And if we keep on going, I think eventually we'll see that, yeah, somebody came from over here in France. And we could keep on going because my dad's side of the gener family tree went, went pretty far. Now I could switch back. I'm gonna zoom back out here on the map. I can switch over to my mom's side and we'll see as soon as we get to my grandparents on my mom's side, suddenly, well, let's go to the let's go to the grandfather side. Came directly from Sweden, and so there's a lot of action going on here in Sweden. You can kind of zoom in and see, oh, where did these people actually come from? Uh, quite interesting. Um, just in the interest of time, let's go through these other tabs. If you click on My Heritage, this just shows you a little bit about where is your heritage from. Now, in my case, mostly from Canada. Um, but when we go back a few generations, quite a bit from Sweden, a little bit from the United States, and then uh, France, which is what you'd expect with a French last name. Pretty interesting. And then over to the timeline, this just shows you where did these generations exist during the various periods of time. So along the bottom, we can look at the um, date bar, and I'm going to just reduce this so that we're looking at only people from the year 1600 to 1800 and where do these people come from a lot from france um, from sweden and still a lot from quebec in fact none were from ontario at this point in my family all from quebec again to be expected with a french last name so i encourage you to have a look at this tool explore where did you come from and connect a little bit more with the people that you came from, your ancestors, but help your children and the rest of your family connect with them as well.